Thank you, Mother, Father, God. Thank you, Archangels and Ascended Masters, for the perfect grace, perfect clarity, and perfect peace that is here for each of us and all of us right now. Thank you to the angelic realm, the elemental realm, our ancestors, spirit guides, animal guides, and guardian angels. We celebrate incredible peace and wonderful love here right now, knowing that peace is here, love is here, and joy is here. If we could just breathe in to Archangel Michael, perhaps being... Um, tiny and him just being right on your shoulder if we could just breathe into archangel michael's very close presence to you and just noticing an angel on your shoulder if we could just breathe into that and if we could just breathe into archangel michael being like an orchestra conductor and him very simply allowing things to be orchestrated for peace for you orchestrating abundance for you orchestrating healing and health for you, orchestrating peace of mind. If we could just breathe and perhaps just breathing in and having that exhale of relief. And we'll just do that again, just breathing in. And if we can indeed just say our own names out loud, I am Mark. And I am. I am willing to receive. I experience grace right now. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for sitting on my shoulder. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for helping me in all ways right now. And if we could just notice, um, like the clog drain clearing, if we could just notice there being flow, we don't need, need to attach to or figure out what is flowing. If we could just breathe in to their being flow, a flow of peace, a flow of progression, a flow of help, a flow of health, a flow of happiness, a flow of energy, and a flow of guidance. If we could just breathe in. And if we could notice Archangel Michael maintaining, perhaps through a hand, contact with your shoulder, with your body, but him taking us full size, and perhaps very tall, we could just breathe into Archangel Michael and his hand on your shoulder being a reassuring hand on your shoulder. And if we could just feel Archangel Michael pouring love into your body and pouring love into your life, and allowing tremendous good to be here right now. And if we could let him polish anything that feels obscured to you, like if the mirror or the window um, were dirty, let's notice Archangel Michael polishing so you could see clearly, see yourself clearly with the eyes of love. And just noticing everything being clear which doesn't mean that we need to figure everything out, but just noticing that the way is clear and our vision is clear. So we'll just breathe into, breathe into that and perhaps noticing some parts of you relaxing. And if we could notice a really relaxed, very serene, Joan of Arc sitting at your feet. And perhaps noticing a very casual Joan sitting there barefoot. And if we could just notice her communicating to you that's really good that you're here. It's really good that you're in this lifetime. It's really good that you're on the planet. It's really good that we're here right now doing this. It's really good that we're communicating and that you're communicating, communing with her and Michael and all the other guides. So we'll just gently breathe into all that.
And if we could notice the structure of sacredness, which might be um, like geographical lines, like a map, if we could just breathe into the structure of sacredness being part of your life right now and you being the epicenter of that in your own life. If we could just breathe in and notice an extension of energy going out from you and energy coming to you. We'll just notice there being alignment and balance and alignment and balance in all aspects of your life, including finances, including energy, including ideas, including health, including healing, everything. If we could just breathe in and just notice that structure, that layout. And if we could notice sacredness, just noticing life being sacred and your life being sacred and this moment being sacred, we'll just notice the angels touch and the blessings of the angels, the blessings of Joan and all the other guides that you know and love and who know and love you. If we could just breathe in to that expanse. And if we could notice a beautiful experience of balance being here right now. And if we could notice there being no distance between you and love and no distance between you and help and no distance between you and health and no distance between you and abundance. So if we could just let distance collapse and just breathe into everything being here right now. And we'll focus on that feeling, that knowing, rather than how. We'll just gently breathe into all that. Wonderful. And if we could notice telepathically or in the core of your heart, if we could just breathe in to messages of reassurance coming to you from all over, from Ashtar watching over the earth, from Kuan Yin, from Ganesh, We'll just gently breathe into all this good. And if we could notice Joan of Arc hugging your legs and perhaps even sitting on your feet. And if we could notice Archangel Michael with his reassuring hand on your shoulder. And if we could just breathe into that reassurance. 
And if we could feel every single cell in your body having a fresh experience, a new experience, a flow and rejuvenation and healing, and just trust that the perfect balance is here. It's okay for you to exist in balance. And the very simple and loving message that you're not done. You're not done growing, you're not done progressing, you're not done earning money, you're not done being visible and healing, you're not done. And if we could feel the continuation of your relationship with the angels and the goddesses and the guides, and the growth that is here, the growth that has happened, the growth that will continue, and the receptivity and allowing that is here. So we'll just breathe in and just notice all this existing, including that map and the sacredness. And if we could notice all that being in the forefront, perhaps in the background, we'll notice the garage door opening and some things being moved out and some things being moved in. A release and an activation, we'll just notice that happening in the background. So we'll just breathe in and notice the sacredness of your journey, of your progression of all the healing that is here, all the healing that has happened, all the healing that is happening, all the healing that will happen. We'll just gently breathe in. Just coming back to the simple fact that you're not done. And it's okay to progress, it's okay to rest, it's okay to trust. It's okay to notice incredible good being here right now. It's okay to notice incredible peace being here right now. It's okay to notice wonderful joy being here right now. Wonderful. If we could notice Archangel Michael moving right behind you and placing both of his reassuring hands on your shoulders. And if we could just notice um, leaning into his heart and relaxing into his heart, Michael's heart. And if we could just gently breathe in and with pure lightness like a feather, feather light, if we could just breathe in and just notice you two years from now. And perhaps just noticing an impression of you being content and feeling light and having even more needs met, perhaps even having more fun being in flow, we'll just notice what's here, being fulfilled, doing things that you want to do, an absence of stress, the presence of love, And we'll just gently breathe in. 
and will feel the sacred progression of things. That indeed not everything changes at once, but we are heading in a direction and we have help. So we'll just breathe and we'll just notice when they bring up our future selves, it's always to provide clarity. And as the snow slides off the roof, that it's okay for things to move. And it's okay for everything to get better. And it's also okay for things that might concern us or worry us now for those things to vanish. So we'll just gently breathe into all that. Wonderful. And if we could just notice with Archangel Michael standing behind you with his hands on your shoulders and Joan of Arc hugging your legs and sitting on your feet, if we could just notice the two of them in conjunction in concert together, if we could just breathe into them, blessing every single bar part of your body, blessing your cells, blessing your systems, blessing your organs, blessing your chakras, blessing your senses, blessing your blood. If we could just notice the two of them in dedicated and peaceful prayer for you, if we could just breathe in and just notice there being a wonderful sense of clearing, clearing of chakras, clearing your voice, clearing your throat, aligning your spine, healing, repairing, fixing, helping, we could just breathe in to a wonderful sense of harmony and care and repair. So we'll just gently breathe into all that. And noticing Archangel Michael making a gesture of like lifting something off of your head. And if we could just let worry be lifted off of your head and concern and tension We'll just let him do that and perhaps instantly feeling your head, your consciousness having more air, more fresh air, more flow. We'll just breathe into that. Wonderful. If we could just breathe into alignment and breathing into sacred alignment and sacred peace and peace of mind. And as Joan of Arc looks up to you and Archangel Michael looks at you, so you can see his face and you can see Joan's face, whether we feel that, see that, hear that, or know that, we'll just breathe in to being seen and being heard and being helped and being cared for and being supported. We'll just gently breathe into that. And we'll notice all of that good. And all of that goodness. There being tremendous peace here. Including tremendous peace of mind. And a beautiful experience of wholeness. And with great gratitude, great peace, great joy, great harmony, let's very simply just take in a deep breath 
And with relaxation, we'll just notice everything getting a bit bigger, including your receptivity, including your will, including allowing, including healing, more healing, more abundance, everything getting bigger. and allowing more, allowing more good, allowing more good days, allowing more good moments, allowing more good news, allowing more freedom, feeling more gratitude, feeling more free, so we'll just gently breathe into all that. And we'll notice the tremendous peace that is here. We'll notice the tremendous love that is here. We'll notice the tremendous harmony that is here. Notice the tremendous joy that is here. So we'll just gently breathe into all that. Nothing is missing. Wonderful. If we could just breathe in. And perhaps with the consistency of cellophane, if we could just notice some old criticism, especially self-criticism, lifting away. And just recognizing the cellophane isn't precious, you are. So we'll just let the filter and whatever caused that filter, whatever created that, you don't need to pay attention to that. We'll just notice Michael and all the other guides, including Joan, lifting that cellophane, that film, that lens off. And we'll just breathe in. Perhaps we could even stretch into there being more space. That we are not perfect beings. We're here to learn. And learning leads to wisdom. And it's okay for us to embrace that wisdom. So we'll just breathe into that. And notice the substantial healing that is here. And the substantial grace that is here. And the tremendous love that is here. And the wholeness and fullness of joy. The wholeness and fullness of peace. Including peace of mind. So we'll just gently breathe into all of that. And if we could notice with immense care, if we could notice Joan standing up and 
once again in concert with Archangel Michael, the two of them working together, Joan and Michael, if we could just notice the parts of you that feel fragile, if we could notice them blessing and healing those parts. And perhaps the same way that we tend to flowers, that they're tending to those fragile parts of you, like a flower. And if we can notice Michael and Joan's gentle reminder that you are not your fragility, that you are whole and complete and evolving. You've done a lot. You gain a lot of wisdom. You have a relationship with the angels and the guides like Michael and Joan. They know you, they care about you, they are helping you. So we'll just breathe into that reminder. And we'll breathe into the clarity and peace that is here. And let's indeed just breathe in and noticing all of that good. And just coming back to, and we'll just breathe into this like it's the first time, Archangel Michael seeing you, hearing you, and caring about you, and him supporting you. Joan of Arc seeing you, hearing you, caring about you, and helping you. Ganesh seeing you, hearing you, caring about you, and helping you. So we'll just breathe into all that. Kuan Yin doing the same. Ashtar doing the same. Kuan Yin doing the same. Archangel Ariel doing the same. So we'll just gently breathe into this sacred space, this expansive space with a grid, a map, balance, harmony, and flow. We'll just gently breathe into all of that. We'll just breathe into the acknowledgement that it's okay for things to change, it's okay for things to get better. We'll trust our friend 1% at a time, that the 1% works, and it's not too little or too much. So we'll just gently breathe into all of this good and all of this peace. And if we could notice Michael and Joan saying your name together in concert. And we'll notice them saying your name like a blessing. And them saying your name with gratitude. And them saying your name with wholeness and fullness. And them saying your name 
with continuation. As in there's a continuation here of this relationship, the continuation of your evolution, the continuation of your healing, the continuation of good things happening and allowing the good to continue and continue and continue and allowing your life to evolve and to expand and for your life to involve grace and involve the angels and guides and involve your wisdom. So we'll just gently breathe into all that. You know, with great clarity and great peace, we'll just gently breathe in. And we'll notice tremendous good thing here. And if we could just breathe in, perhaps stretch into a sense of relief and release. And noticing wonderful love and great grace being here right now. And to Archangel Michael and Joan of Arc, we'll say out loud, thank you. To Ganesh and Kuan Yin and Ashtar and Ariel and all the other guides, we'll say out loud, thank you. For this sacred space and to this sacred space and the map, the grid, the expanse, we'll say out loud, thank you. To our future self, our future selves, we say out loud, thank you. We say out loud to them, good job. And to ourselves in this moment right now, allowing change, inviting changes, we say out loud, good job. And with grace and ease and peace and joy, we celebrate this moment as we thank the presence of Mother, Father, God, and all the Archangels and Ascended Masters. We thank as well the angelic realm, the elemental realm, our ancestors, spirit guides, animal guides, and guardian angels. We celebrate peace and joy and harmony right now, knowing that tremendous love is part of our day and part of our experience. And with beautiful expansion and wonderful peace, we celebrate this moment and we ask for this or something better right now in all directions of time, and so it is. Mm -hmm.